You can't blame him. She needs dying. Doesn't mean he can have a go at you like that. He's not just angry, though. He wants to burn the whole world to the ground. Yes, I get that. Life's short. We spend so much time fannying around and worrying about things that don't matter. Look, I really like you. No, I get it, I get it. You read my article, I'm damaged goods. What are you on about? You're gorgeous. Don't. It's not you, honest. It's me. Seriously? Is that the best you can do? It is me. I'm gay. Sorry, excuse me. Hey, Bethany, wait. Don't tell me those two have had a lover's tiff already. Just get the music back on. Oh, I can't. Sorry. Please. You won't tell anyone, will you? I'm going home. What was all that about? Uh, nothing. It wasn't nothing. Just leave it, yeah? Shouldn't you be at the party humiliating some other poor girl? Let me explain. What? Explain what? That you're too much of a coward to come out as gay so you have to use girls to pretend to be straight? It's not that simple. Well, it's a lot more complicated doing what you're doing. You don't get it. Well, don't patronise me. I might be straight, but I've got plenty of gay friends. And yeah, some of them have been through bad times with it all, but you know that parade that they throw every summer with the floats and the drag queens and the rainbow flags? It's called Pride, James. Not shame, Pride. I know. When I got back here, I was feeling sorry for myself. But you know what? It's actually you that I feel sorry for. Think of all the gay people in the back end of nowhere that are too scared to come out because they live in such tiny communities. Well, you live in Manchester, one of the coolest cities in the country. You're nice looking, you've got a fantastic job. A job you... is why I can't come out. Oh, give me a break. Billy is a vicar. Do you think he had it easy with the church? It's not the same. Well, they can't discriminate against you. It's illegal. Don't mean the club. Although there'll be a few of them that would look at me funny, it's the fans. There's always going to be some idiots about. Yeah, it might only be a minority, but it's more than a few idiots. Have you heard some of the racist stuff they chant on the terraces? I've never been to a football match. Well, stick being gay on top of being black. Some fans from the opposing teams would make my job impossible. Why do you think football is one of the only sports where no players have come out as gay? That's not right, though, is it? You don't have to tell me that. And as cool as he is, I really don't know how my dad would react either. <sighs> anyway, I just wanted to check that you were okay. And you're right. I shouldn't have used you like I did. You don't deserve that. I'm sorry. <laughs>